students learn intentionally when they work on a vocabulary lesson. The internet has lots of opportunities to find vocabulary for students to learn intentionally. They learn incidentally when they participate in fun, interesting, language-rich activities in English. And again, the internet is a great source for these because the internet has so much English language content and so many social media spaces that attract English speakers. Social media provides an opportunity for people around the world with common interests in a cultural event, location, person, or group to connect, share, and communicate. When learners develop a passion for a game, musical group, author, or sports team, for example, they become fans. And fans like to experience more and more of the object they are attracted to. Researchers, teachers, and students have noted that the passion of a fan is ideal for gaining a large amount of exposure to the language used to enjoy the cultural event, person, or group. Repeated exposure to vocabulary is great for incidental vocabulary learning. The best way to see how this works is to learn about it from a fan. Let's ask Hannah Kim to provide some insight on how being a fan might help with incidental vocabulary learning. Hannah, what can you tell us about learning vocabulary by being a fan? I'm really interested in this topic probably because I was once a big fan of Harry Potter as an English learner years ago. And today I see English learners taking so many opportunities to participate in fan communities through social media. As a researcher today, I've been investigating the language experiences of English learners who are fans of BTS. I'll tell you about that research, but first I should explain about my early experiences as a Harry Potter fan. When I was about 10 years old, an old family friend from England came to see my family in South Korea and gifted me a book named Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone. This was the first novel in the Harry Potter series that hooked me on reading all of the Harry Potter books and watching all of the Harry Potter movies that came out. Not just once, but multiple times. After more than 20 years, it's amazing to see how I still get excited when I see anything Harry Potter related, such as Harry Potter Legos, clothes, and I find myself following Harry Potter fan pages on Facebook. Even though I've watched the movies multiple times, I could spend an entire day re-watching Harry Potter movies. Just the thought of it makes me really happy. Recently, I have found several Harry Potter podcasts, which I've been enjoying listening to as well. I learned how strong the intrinsic motivation of a fan can be through my experience as a Harry Potter fan. As an English language learner in South Korea, there weren't many channels to receive English input other than English classes in school. In this context, the English exposure that I got from Harry Potter books, movies, and online fan communities really helped me learn vocabulary and just English in general, even outside of the classroom. Being a fan presents language learners with lots of opportunities to learn language incidentally.